What's up guys and welcome back to Daily Bites. Today's video we're going to be doing an unboxing of the Foxtel IQ5. Now there's going to be three parts to this basically setup journey. We're going to be doing the unboxing right here. Then we're going to be showing you what cables you really need to plug into the box, basically the activation process, all that kind of cool stuff. And thirdly, a full on review and look on the interface, UI, everything with the box. So with this video, let's show you the unboxing, what you get, and basically all that. And we saw your votes on uh, the Daily Bytes community, and you guys have asked for a Foxtel IQ5 video, and that is exactly what we're going to do today. So I picked up the equipment today, and this is basically what we picked up. So we've got two boxes, and we've got a cable, and this little thing, which we'll go into that very soon. So, let's dive into it, and thanks again for voting to do a Foxtel video. We do thank you very much for voting for that. Let's dive in. So my battery went a little bit flat, so I do apologize if I'm not 100% even on the camera quality. Do apologize for that. So basically the, the two things that I got here is let's unbox the IQ box. I think the first is what we want to have a look at. First of all, I'll just show you this little thing that they give you. And this is basically how to set it up. So as you see right here, you got your power, I'm showing that in the wrong order, it's this one. You got your satellite cables, you've got your antenna, then you've got your HDMI and your power. Um, and actually, if you don't know what you're doing, it actually shows you just behind here, but don't worry, if you're not sure what you're doing, I have a video coming up to show you exactly what to do, especially if you're using satellite or IP services. We'll show you how to do that. They also give you an antenna outlet, which is interesting because the Foxtel are basically trying to get you not to use satellite, so they will not give you satellite cables anymore. So if you're expecting to get satellite cables, you won't, you'll just get one. And this is purely for your antenna only, and that's the antenna basically plug-in. Um, so yeah, if you're wanting to have satellite, you'll need to buy your own cables with your own cost. Foxtel will not provide that kind of stuff. So just keep that in mind. So if you've got some lying around, if you don't, you're just gonna have to use IP services because purely that's what Foxtel's focus is. Not really satellite based anymore, more basically have it via, uh, via IP, okay? Uh, that's kind of where they want their vision to go. So let's open up the box. Now this is the same brand that your MBN, especially HFC, so it's with the Ash uh, brand. Now we'll just open that up and we'll show you what's in the box. So first of all, when you open the top of it, that's what you get in the box. So let's have a look what this little letter is. So it's just a safety guide, we don't really need to look into that. So under that, then you've got the box, the Foxtel box. Now it's quite a small little boxy. Um, so yeah, it's quite small, very tiny. Okay, uh, so we'll just open up that. Right there, that's the box. Nice and tiny, and at the back of it, well, let's just show you what you get here. So you get your power, you get your optical thing. Uh, that's for your surround sound audio systems. You've got your USB so you can charge stuff in there. You've also got a HDMI and internet, which is crucial for if you're using the IP services. Then you've got your antenna, and then lastly, which uh, not many people will be using these days, is your satellite, but that will still work. Okay? Then at the bottom here, we have the power supply, which is will come in handy and you get a 4K, obviously, HDMI. Then under this part, there's one last thing, which is the remote. Now, I was a little bit disappointed, the fact that um, it's the old logo, if you can see there. So it's the old logo, and that's everything in that part of the box. So that's everything there. So we can just move all that aside. Then let's go have a look at the hard drive box. So when you open up the hard drive box, you will see your hard drive here. Now you don't have to plug in your hard drive box, uh, but if you don't, you won't be able to record stuff, okay? Anyway, most of the time you won't need to record stuff because everything is basically string nowadays, so you wouldn't really need the hard drive, but if you still want to have a backup hard drive, you do have it at the moment. Foxtel may charge extra in the future for this, because I do notice when you order online, it says it comes with free hard drive, but in the future, you may have to pay an additional fee to get the hard drive. I'm not too sure though. So basically, I'm not too sure how you open the hard drive. Oh yeah, here we go. Click this open. Just open that 
for you. Okay, we got it out. So we'll just rip the plastic. And this should be a 1TB drive. Let's just have a look. Specifically doesn't say, but I know it is um, a one terabyte hard drive. So that is the hard drive. And basically to plug that in, you need to pull this little flap out, this little silicone thingy, pull that out. And then line that up with there, and then you can just plug that in. Like it's not too hard to do, it's very, uh, very simple. And that's basically the full size of your IQ5 box. So that's the IQ5, that's basically the unboxing, what you get. As I said, you've got all the cables here, um, you've got your remote, you've got your antenna cable, uh, your power, and that's it. So that's basically everything right there. Uh, one interesting thing I found that you don't get is there's no number to call to activate your box. So that's very interesting. So will it just know when I plug it in, it's just gonna automatically activate? That I'm not too sure. Um, so we're gonna investigate all that in our next video, but that is basically the unbox. That's what you get. And hopefully that gives you a bit of an idea of the hardware and all that kind of cool stuff. And I'll just check the version of this, what IQ5 it is because you should know by the model. So, because a lot of you guys might be curious what model that I actually am mucking around with. And so this is just a 2023 model, okay? It doesn't specifically say anything else. Um, yeah, it just says IQ5. So yeah, it's just 2023 model. Um, nothing really that interesting. And I'll just show you there. That's what model we're dealing with, okay? All right, guys, so the next thing is obviously a setup, basically the setup process, what we have to do, and all that kind of stuff, and hopefully you join us on that journey and setting it up. And yeah, thanks for watching. Hey there, lovely viewers. Thanks for tuning in to today's episode of Daily Bites. I hope you enjoyed it as much as we enjoyed making it for you. If you haven't already, make sure to hit that big, shiny subscribe button below. By subscribing to our channel, you won't miss any of our exciting daily content. We have lots of great stuff in store for you, and we'd love to have you as a part of our growing community. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you found it entertaining or informative. It really helps us out and motivates our team to keep producing awesome content for you. Also, remember to share this video with your friends and family. Sharing is caring, and who knows, they might enjoy it as much as you did. We truly appreciate all your support and engagement. Without you, our wonderful viewers, none of this would be possible. So, thank you for being a part of Daily Bites. Until next time, stay curious and keep exploring the world of technology with us. Take care and see you soon.